standing now as we read and hear the Word of God from Isaiah chapter 9 and then John chapter 1, Isaiah 9 and John chapter 1. We're reading verses 6 to 7 of Isaiah 9. Hear now God's holy, inspired, infallible, and errant word. For unto us a child is born, and to us a son is given, and the government will be upon his shoulder, and his name will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the increase of his government and peace there will be no end. Upon the throne of David and over his kingdom to order it and establish it with judgment and justice from that time forward, even forever. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. Turn now to John chapter 1. Be reading verses 14 to 18. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. John bore witness of him and cried out, saying, This was he of whom I said, He who comes after me is preferred before me, for he was before me. And of his fullness we have all received, and grace for grace, for the law was given through Moses, but grace and truth came. Through Jesus Christ, no one has seen God at any time.